Vlog three, day three, coffee in hand. Let's get started. Today's vlog is titled Fixing Mistakes. Uh, so what I'm wanting to do is uh, create a table saw um, bench, essentially, around my table saw. I got a nice idea off of YouTube, and I wanted to create this. So I started creating it, and I've made a few mistakes as I go. And I'm going to run through a few of those. Yeah. So this is my workbench, or workbench going to be. Uh, on that side, I'm going to be putting some drawers. And on that side is going to be a router table. I'm going to put some drawers at the bottom. And then at the top, I'm going to have a router table there. In the middle, in this section over here, I'm going to put my table saw. I'm going to take that and I'm going to put it into there okay now making all the me measurements and the adjustments and everything like that I have somehow made a mistake right um, the gap between this brace and the back brace is meant to be 50 centimeters and when I put it all together I created the frame uh, so the outside frame the front and then the frame at the back I created that um, as separate pieces. Then I created these internal um, pieces of your cabinets, should I say, those internal cabinets I created. And I measured the internal space from for the cabinets to be 50 centimeters. But what I didn't take into consideration is the thickness of the frame. Because those cabinets are set inside of the frame so it fits in into there and if we have a look over here you can see it fits in there so I didn't take into consideration the th consideration the thickness of this and this is 18 mils so I've got an 18 mils this side and then I've got 18 mils that side too long so this board is 50 centimeters which is correct, but add on this 18 centimeters, add on that 18 centimeters, and we're sitting with 36 centimeters too much, ah, 36 millimeters too much. And that brings a problem. And that problem comes into here with this, with the uh, edgings, which means I cannot use my uh, fence efficiently enough. Now I have two options. I actually have only got one option. I have to take this all apart, cut the internal cabinets down to size, cut those down to size, and put it all back together again. It's a good thing I haven't glued it yet. Let's speed the process up. As I'm going through here, it's just a matter of breaking it down, cutting the pieces again a little bit shorter, and then putting it all back together again. In the meantime, today has been quite an interesting day. I think I've been um, challenged by all, all, all this work that needs to be done. I've got a new respect for vloggers and you know, YouTubers and the amount of work that they put into getting really good quality uh, content out there. So, yeah. Uh, <laughs> It's amazing. This journey has opened my eyes up a lot, I must say, and uh, it can be quite stressful. The table saw bench that I'm doing is something I got off uh, of YouTube. Um, there will be a link at the bottom. It's from Payson's or Powson's. I'm not sure if I'm saying it right. Uh, please excuse me, but it's from his woodworking uh, YouTube site and. Um, the, you can buy plans and things from his site online, and it's it's quite it's worth having a look at. He's very good at what he does, and that's where I got the idea of what I'm doing.